Hello all. Uh, as a senior design project in MEC 491, we made a haptic joystick and it's an application of mechatronics. And haptics is this sense of touch. Uh, our aim in this project is to uh, is to um, simulate what a person feels in a virtual environment. And uh, we made a virtual spin mechanism. And uh, our project has two applications. One of them is compressing and releasing the spring and uh, feeling the applied force. And the second one is uh, hitting a virtual wall. Uh, we use 3D printed parts and Arduino and MATLAB in our uh, project. This is our project, electronics and mechanics. Electronic part consists of an Arduino, a breadboard and the motor. We use an Arduino Uno with motor shield sensor to get the data from the sensors. We use two magnet resistive sensors to get the angle data and one force resistive sensor to give a relation between force and the motor voltage. We use LED whose brightness increase or decrease according to the motor voltage. We use 12 volt 5600 RPM motor to create a force of the virtual spring. We put a magnet at the end of the motor shaft and with each turn the angle data is measured with magnet resistive sensors. Our design differs from the others with an addition of the second magnet resistive sensors, a LED and the mod force sensors. We use second sensor to get the direction of the each turn. Here is an overview of our system. The user moves the handle of the joystick. This motion is sensed by the sensors and sent to the computer through the mechatronics interface. The digital position is computed and a force is rendered in the virtual environment. This force is then transferred to the joystick, again through the mechatronics interface, and applied on the user. Now I would like to make you a demo of our project. Uh, this is a, a spring application. So as you can see, I am compressing the spring and the corresponding forces are rendered and applied on my hand and I can feel that it's getting harder to push forward the board. Now the spring is fully compressed. Now, now I'm releasing it. Now there's no force applied on my hand because I'm not pushing. Here's the second application of our project. Uh, I'm going to demonstrate to you a virtual wall application. I'm moving the joystick freely until I hit a wall and I can't go any further. So I'm going back. I hit the wall again and I feel the force applied on my hand. 